Islamophobia, sexism, racism, transphobia, ageism and homophobia. Hate crime can take many forms. Whether scrawled on the wall or shouted in the street, these acts go underreported nationwide. A lot of people will kind of see quite low level hate crime happen to them, but they maybe don't report it because they don't see it as a big deal. Um, and so a big challenge that we have with hate crime is raising awareness of it and encouraging people to come forward if something has happened to them. Matt Mottishead was in a Liverpool club when he was victimised for being gay. And, uh, there was this group of guys who were in the club and they kept giving me funny looks and it was all a bit odd. And then uh, they shouted something to me and I didn't quite hear it and we moved a bit closer and then they started, I realised they started shouting homophobic slurs to me. And then it all just got really heated and uh, one of them punched me and one of them like uh, tried to like push me down, it was awful. No, I didn't report it to anyone, I didn't think uh, anyone, like it happens all the time, I didn't think anyone would really care or I didn't go to the police or anything. I don't think they could really do much about this kind of thing. According to Home Office statistics released today, incidences of hate crime have risen by 18% nationally. Here at their Challenging Hate Crime Conference in Liverpool, policymakers and experts are coming together to find solutions to combat hate crime. In a city as increasingly diverse as Liverpool, it is unsurprising that hate crime statistics appear to have risen. However, authorities say that this is encouraging as it means more people are coming forward. I think that as a whole, Liverpool is an incredibly welcoming city. Um, I think that we really bond together as communities. Um, you will always get those spots in those minority communities where they maybe don't gel so well and you do get into of hate crime. Um, I think as a whole, though, we all kind of like pull together and kind of tackle it. And I think that's a good example of what we've done.